Okay, the second type of models, we call them the uh, marginal models. Uh, of course, the meaning of the word is very clear. Margin means they are secondary, they are not very important. Uh, these uh, marginal uh, uh, models, we have three uh, samples of. The first one is used to. The second one, we have need. And the third one, we have there. So these are, we call them, uh, uh, marginal model. Why? Because uh, especially those two behave can behave as lexical sometimes and as marginal model. So if we come or we talk about the first one, so let's take this example and see. If we say like Peter used to smoke say a lot before say before lunch. See, for example, if we have such a sentence, Peter used to smoke a lot before lunch. And this, first of all, considering the meaning, in most cases, used to, uh, used to describe an action which is uh, not good, let's say bad uh, condition, bad uh, behavior, used to be uh, done or uh, performed in the past, but no, no, nowadays it is not uh, no longer used. This is mostly, but it is possible to have a, a habit, general habit used in the past, and today or nowadays it is not used. So if we take, for example, Peter, as we know, this is the subject, and the verb is used to smoke, and before the lunch, uh, this is the rest or the complement of the sentence. So this is concerning the verb. As we know that Peter used to smoke before time. Uh, by the way, the present of this form is Peter, if we want to change it, for example, I ask you, change this sentence, which is referring to the past, this is to the past, and if I ask you to change the, to the present, we say, Peter, what, say, smokes, what, smokes, a lot, etc. So, all this verb can be changed into one word, we say, Peter, smoke, this is in case of our in case of the uh, present. In case of, let's say, negation, if we want to negate this sentence, we make it negative. So we say we have possibilities. Either we say, Peter, what used not. See, because we consider used as what? As auxiliary, as a model. So in this case, we add what? Not. We add not. We say, Peter used not. Then we say, to smoke a lot, etc. So this is the first case we use Peter used not. Or we can say Peter did not used to smoke and this is etc. See, we say use, not used. Why? Because in most cases if we have did, then the verb that comes after not should be in the present. The third possibility we can say what? We can say Peter, what did not used to. Again, see, used to smoke a lot, etc. See, then we have three possibilities for negation to this verb. Either by using what? By using not. Then, I mean used, we consider as auxiliary. So like cannot, should not, may not. We say use not. Or we say did, we can use by did. We say did not use without D, or we can say Peter did not used. In this case, we put it the full form. In case of a question, and this is, I think, simple, and since we consider this as auxiliary, so we just put it at the beginning of the sentence, and we say used Peter to smoke, smoke, etc. Then we say what? To smoke a lot, then before lunch. And this is what? And as we said, any sentences start with a verb, and this is a verb, so the answer can be either yes or no question, just we replace this. This is concerning the use to. And by the way, you have to differentiate this expression, used to, with used with is preceded by what? Preceded by B. For example, we can say Peter, Peter, for example, is used to say smoke, etc. The same. See the difference here between is if preceded, in this case, 
here we used to is not what used to is not a model or not a verb why because the main verb is what is is this is different expression with different meaning so this is concerning the used to the second marginal uh, model verb is what is the need need this verb can be as a model and can be i mean model verb and can be an lexical verb for example we can say she need say see her doctor let's say every week in this case this is what this is a model why because if it is not model we have to say what we say she need she needs we add s but because it is a model like she can she will she should we say she need then we have c because we know that after the model after the model verb we have she need her in case of negation we say she what she need not see in case of negation say she need again she not then see her doctor every and in case of a question we say need say need she see her doctor in case of a question we put just put this need at the beginning of the question this is in case of what in case of as a marginal model as a lexical verb no in this case it behaves like any verb for example we can say tom needs money to complete for example his project or house whatever see in this case we say tom needs we added what s like any verb wants reads uh, 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 drinks whatever say tom needs in case of negation not like this so in case we say tom what tom does not then we say what need this is without s tom does not need money etc in case of a question again we put does at the beginning of the uh, the, the uh, question or the sentence we say does then tom what need money etc then question mark because why we started with what with this uh, do at the beginning of the uh, does at the beginning of the question so need can behave as a either as a marginal model or like any lexical what lexical verb the third uh, type is what is there there also there can be what can be a model and can be what marginal model and can be what can be uh, any lexical verb so in case this is considering the there as a model for example lara we can say there talk to her say boss see lara there talk lara there we didn't say what there's and also it is possible to say lara there too we can say lara there to talk in both cases correct means we can add but we don't have what s in this case the same thing with need we deal with what with for example in case of negation we can say what instead we say lara what we say there not see there not to talk or talk etc in case of a question we put it at the beginning question and we say what we say there lara talk to her boss or her headmaster or etc then we have what we have the question mark so the same thing what is applicable to uh, need is also applicable to what to there and finally we consider or we regard uh, as what as any uh, lexical verb so for example my friend so for example there's me to spend a night for example in a graveyard this is uh, like this so in this case it is that it is what it is a lexical that's why we say my friend there's there's 
me to spend, there's me. So in case we have a plural, we don't say, well, if we have, for example, my friends, and they say, we say, there. But if we have my friend, just one person, so we put this uh, S of the third person singular. In case of negation, we can say, for example, what? My friend, what? Instead of, we say, does not dare me, etc. So, again, we put what? Does plus what? Plus dare. Since it is what? Lexical. Like speak, like swim, etc. Uh, finally, in case of a question, we put it at the uh, beginning of the question and we say, does, for example, my friend or your friend, according to uh, the meaning, uh, do, uh, does uh, my friend say what? Dare. In this case, we do not what? So, because we have does, so we remove the S of the third, uh, th the S of the third person singular. So, this is, uh, um, so in brief, concerning uh, the marginal models. We have, as we said, we have a three. The first one, used to. The second one, we have me. And the third one, we have there. For those, uh, for this need and there can be uh, lexical and can be uh, model auxiliaries at uh, different or according to uh, the usage of the uh, of these verbs. Used to, the present of used to is use, but we don't have uh, present for used to as uh, this, mar this uh, marginal model. So hopefully this is clear for you. Uh, in case you have a question, you have uh, to ask uh, later. Thank you.